Hola gente, ¿cómo están? Soy De Asuma y sean bienvenidos una vez más a The Life is Stranger. Vamos a continuar con Max. Después de haberle dado una lección a las zorras del curso por haber querido pasarse de listas con ella. La mejor cosa que pudimos haber hecho fue lanzarle pintura sobre la cabeza. Ahorita estamos yendo a nuestra habitación porque debo encontrar el pendrive de mi amigo para entregárselo. Ok. Hurry, Courtney. What the fuck? Oh, oh, oh. Victoria is going to be pissed we talked so habitación long. estaba acá el último. La verdad es que eh, hubiera sido increíble estudiar en una universidad así, ¿no? Max. Home sweet home, my favorite cocoon. Vamos a mirarnos en el espejo. Hard to believe I'm 18. Do I look any older? Just the best. What the fuck? Pues en escuela, estás en universidad. Okay, el director me traicionó. Maldito director. ¿Qué es esto? Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Vamos a ver qué dice. Oye chica, pedí prestado el pendrive para que puedas mirar algunas películas mientras estudio. Si lo necesitas, búsqueme en mi habitación. Shosho D. Shosho D. Great. Okay. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Tengo que ir a buscar el pendrive de la habitación de Shosho. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Let me out, Julia. This is so stupid. Answer, you wuss. Juliet. Thank you. You are ridiculous. Ah, creo que había otro lado, ¿no? Wampy. Ah, this is Max. Hey Juliet, is everything cool? Oh yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. She's your friend. Friends don't sex with their best friend's boyfriend. No, probably not. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk, just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Juliet... Ju Juliet Olsen. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Okay, vamos a cambiar el nombre. Juliet Watson. Hey, Juliet. Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dan... Okay, to this Juliet. Watson. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Uh, of course I do. Thanks. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. If you don't let me out, I will scream. Would Dana do that? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext. And Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't do anything. But I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. I'm not letting her out until she tells the truth. Dana's still a cheerleader at heart. Oh. 
At least that's an alarm from this century. Could be fun. Thanks for the warning. I see the dumb hipsters in the air. ¿Puedo borrar el pizarrón a todos? Ah, no, solo ahí. Okay. Entrar a la habitación, ya, yeah, my friend. Don't stay. What's the problem? O sea, ¿todos son fotógrafos aquí? ¿Qué ocurre? At least she puts her photographs out there. Unlike me. Wow. Dior, Givenchy, you could pay for my tuition with that wardrobe. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. Una impresora 3D. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. And for this nice shot. Boom! This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Ya tengo las pruebas necesarias para demostrarle de que no han tenido sex out the core. Okay, This better convinced Juliet that Dana is innocent. Sí, sería lo mejor porque así me dejas que me den mis porquerías. Ok, Max, como que estás mucho más activo que otros días. O sea que poco. Juliet, estamos... read this. Oh, sí, en tu cara, bitch. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. Almost <laughs> open, right, Brown? I better make sure everything is still in there. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. This is both sad and pathetic. Dana. Apesto escribiendo, pero pensé que debería escribir esto para que puedas no odiar mi tarado trasero para siempre. Sé que actúo como un atleta duro alrededor de todo el mundo, pero nunca tuve esa actitud alrededor. Soy un tipo de hombre, no soy el tipo de hombre que te mereces. Ya he visto cómo has asustado. Si necesitas dinero, dímelo. Yo lo hago. What the fuck? Bueno, Dana, vamos a hablar. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. 
Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. When you opened the flash drive, didn't you see the special folder called Max? Yeah, okay. I gotcha. Okay, debo ir a buscar a Warren. ¿Dónde cojones está Warren? Déjame ir a mi habitación. Espero volver a ver qué pasa. Here's my go-to source for instant photo inspiration. I better make sure everything is still in there. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. Okay. Debo volver al estacionamiento con Warren. A ver, tenía que salir de la institución. Ah, aquí están los mensajes de Warren. Oh, oh. Fuck this shit. Oh, I know. Damn, I better rewind. All right. Fuck this shit. Ow, that hurt. Alyssa. Move your head. If you insist, Max. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. Ya mismo, ya mismo. Acabé de salvarle la vida a la gordita de que muera aplastada por un balón asesino. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. That asshole was so over the line. I could rewind and try something different. Why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. 
Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. Yo soy oh, de un barro duro, maldito. Great. I think you scared him for once. I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after. Barrio duro, tío. Barrio duro, entiende. Soy Max. Soy Max, nigga. Vamos a ver a Warren. Oh, Dios, ¿por qué se demora tanto? Era Warren, ¿Eh? me lo imaginaba más sepsi. Ok, go, Max. I'm glad I stepped in that time. Can't stand to see people go being bullied. Go. Yo, Max, check it out. What up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. No problem. Check out my new wheels. Cool, very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then, so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. I bet. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. We'll see. <laughs> in serio? Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? Mm, sí, gracias. Yeah, Me thanks. You had some cool shit on there, from Akira to Twilight Zone, which seems apropos today. I consider myself a pop cultural pirate connoisseur. That does sound better than thief. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. Hablan sobre cosas que se han dado en realidad en el arte cinematográfico. Seen it. I was more disturbed by all those emo vampire movies in there. Can a sensitive high school boy love sensitive vampires too? So you're sensitive. Ouch. That sounds awful the way you say it. Faster pussycat no, kill. No, I was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white. Plus, babes with breasts. Who would beat your <laughs> sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. Uh, okay, tengo que hablar de eso. I need to talk to somebody, just to get it out of my system. Dr. Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me everything. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you saw, now. Answer me, bitch. Nothing but a butterfly. You're full of shit. I'd respect you more if you told me the truth. I don't need your respect. You're clueless. You have no idea who I am or what I can do. Actually, I have a pretty good idea of who you are. Do not analyze me! I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. I could call the police. Do it! The Prescotts own the pigs here. Get away from her, dude! What the fuck? Hey! Leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore Wait in the bathroom! <gasps> Thank you. 
Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Warren! Go! Go! I got this! Get in, Max! Get your punk asses out of there now! Don't even try to run! Nobody! Nobody! O sea, es infeliz, hace lo que le da la gana y nadie le dice nada en el colegio, que es imbécil. Man, Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day Maldito never Nathan. ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? I have no idea. I know he's a Prescott. And an asshole. Your friend really stood up for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. Feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? I guess. It was cool, but I felt kind of lonely out of my league. I would think you'd fit right in with the art school hipsters. Right. You look like the cover of hipstergirl.com. At least you're still a smartass. That's why I'm here. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Of course, it's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. I'm sorry. I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. <laughs> I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. I haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it at my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. Bienvenida a casa, Max. Y hasta aquí me voy a quedar yo. Ha sido un placer grabar este cuarto capítulo Y esto fue The Life is a Stranger Gente, yo sé que he dejado de subir videos casi 6 meses Pero es porque hemos estado haciendo muchas cosas en la comunidad de LOL Así que les doy gracias por aquel que está viendo este video Y le animo a que siga viendo poco a poco las cosas que voy a ir subiendo Trataré de eliminar ciertos ruidos, ciertas Come cosas Y mejorar la calidad de lo que voy haciendo nice. Por ahora shit, dejaremos a Max con Chloe En su casa solas sin entender muy bien por qué lo hacen. Así que gente, say goodbye.